Hello everyone, welcome to another Windows 10 video. My name is Ed and in this video I want to talk to you about ISO files. Now if you are somebody that's new to Windows, um, if you give you a little bit of a history about Windows is in previous versions you didn't have the capability of mounting ISO files. I'm talking about like Windows 7 um, and earlier and you had to load third, either third-party software or if you we're one of those people that had like a DVD writer or something in a machine that would have like power DVD or power ISO for example um, and there was other brands as well ultra ISO etc that you'd have to install to be able to mount ISO files in Windows 10 you are able to mount ISO files automatically now I wanted to show you this I downloaded Windows 8.1 and you can see that um, it identifies this as a disk image and when I double click the disk image it basically opens it like it would a zip file for example now as you can see it's loaded it under my PC if I go to my PC now it picks up that my E drive is basically a, an ISO file that was mounted it, it's almost like a DVD or a CD so just to show you the ease of use um, of doing of having this capability in Windows 10 just makes your life a lot easier so as mentioned if you are new to Windows 10 um, you don't have to load any third-party software because Windows already has it built in and the same thing if you want to um, eject this you can eject the ISO and it'll basically show you that you have an empty or disk again. Now if I go back to downloads you'll see I can just remount it and it'll be back again and I can if I wanted to run the setup which I don't uh, in this case but whatever you had in your ISO whether you created an, an your own ISO with you know personal files or something you now can just load it within Windows and run it and you can access the files. And that's pretty much how straightforward it is to mount ISO files in Windows 10. Thank you very much for watching.